Hey, so today I am back in the great state of Texas. I am at Palo Duro Canyon State Park, just south of Amarillo. I have now been to every single part of the great state of Texas. Let me show you what I'm looking at. There you go. Palo Duro Canyon State Park. This is the second largest canyon in North America behind the Grand Canyon. Now it's nowhere near as big as the Grand Canyon, not even close, but it's still really cool. It's about 800 feet down to the bottom. I'm actually camped at the very bottom. I'll have to show you that later on. Now the last few days we have been in Fort Sumner, New Mexico. shot a video from there but it kind of well it wasn't a very good video but I did go to the Billy the Kid Museum Fort Sumner is where Billy the Kid was shot and killed by Pat Garrett and is buried there so that's pretty cool but today we're back in Texas and this is what we're getting to see all right, let me show you my campsite. First off, here's my scenery. That's pretty cool. Pretty big site I'm in. I'm in site 96 of the Mesquite Loop. It's really cool, let me show you. Yeah. As you can see, really big spacious site. Got my two vehicles there, my trailer. I just stayed hooked up because everything was pretty level and we're only gonna be here a couple days, so I just stayed hooked up. You can see you got a little covered picnic table there. Pretty awesome. You see the dirt here is kind of a mixture of red dirt and sand. Yeah. Pretty cool. Nice sight. Very busy place. There's a lot of people here. There you go. So to give you an idea of how crowded this park gets, it's a Saturday morning. Actually, it's Saturday afternoon. It is one o'clock. We just went to the laundromat, washed our clothes. We come back. I just now passed a sign that says State Park one and a half miles and we are sitting still in traffic. Let me show you. Yep. That's a big line of traffic. So after sitting in line for an hour and 10 minutes to get through the gate, we ate a little lunch and we're going to hike a little trail. It's a beautiful day, 70 degrees and a cloudless sky. This trail I'm on goes through a little area where they have cabins. These are really cool looking. Uh, here's some views from the canyon along this trail. Let me give you a panoramic view here. near like the Grand Canyon but you're really easily able to come down in the canyon and explore and have fun it's not easy to do that at the Grand Canyon really cool check out these big boulders across the way that's pretty neat looks like a little cave up there that's pretty neat yeah this is a pretty pretty place very pretty. Cool. 
All right, so we've come up on another big cave. We're gonna go in this one and check it out. Yeah, so you can see what kind of terrain this is going up in here. Yeah, it's pretty tough. Yeah, now we're making it. This is pretty cool. I feel like I'm on Indiana Jones. I'm getting ready to walk in here and find some kind of treasure or a bunch of snakes. <laughs> yeah, this is neat. Really, really neat. There's your video shot looking out. Pretty neat. All right, now we're on top of the cave. You can see, you can go down in that hole right there. That is wild. Now I'm directly on top of this cave. Yeah. This is pretty cool stuff right here. You can see, this is where you enter on the top. This would be a great place to hide out from enemies. The only thing you might have to worry about is a rattlesnake here and there. But yeah. Well, I made it back. That turned into a little bit more of an adventure than I planned, but hey, that's great. So I've now been to 19 state parks in the state of Texas. I've camped at 17. I gotta say, they're not the best in the country, but they're not bad. They have some really, really, really good ones, and then some of them are mm, not really all that great. But all in all, I love the state of Texas. I really do. Um, it's really funny, they call this Texas's Grand Canyon. I've been to the Grand Canyon I've been to Texas Grand Canyon. I've been to the Grand Canyon of the South, which is Brakes Interstate Park, which is in Kentucky and Virginia, right on the border. Um, and it's okay. But I've been to Georgia's Little Grand Canyon, Providence Canyon, it's in South Georgia. That is a really cool place if you're ever down that way, check out. But this here is a really cool place. It's right off I well, it's not far off from I 40. Uh, just south of Amarillo, if you're heading across country, heading to the Big Grand Canyon, come check this one out. Stay a night. You can get around and explore some of this and kind of get you ready for the Big Grand Canyon. So, anyway, whatever you do, get out and enjoy God's creation because it's always an adventure.